Hi, I'm Kim, Executive Vice President at Discover Lehigh Valley. I'm a graduate of the CIA. No, not that CIA. The Culinary Institute of America. I've got the perfect recipe to uncover the best dining and dishes in Lehigh Valley. Let's go. I'm here at Yule's Oyster House in Allentown. I'm joined by Christian Philippos, proprietor of this restaurant, and he's going to give us the dish on why you should check this place out. Thanks for stopping in, Kim. As you know, we had a fire, destroyed the building, right. and we had to start from scratch, which gave us an opportunity to really provide a nice dining facility with all the accoutrements that we lacked before. Well, it looks absolutely fantastic. I was here before the fire, Christian, and the place looks totally different to me. A lot of natural lights come in, I love the view on the mezzanine level. What else has changed about the place? Well, we have a limited footprint at this location. It's a small lot in a residential neighborhood. So we're restricted in size. We don't have a lot more square feet than we did. We have a lot more cubic feet. So it's a more open concept restaurant. It's beautiful. I love the bar area. The old bar was very closed in, I think, when you walked in the door. Right. This is really opened up. We have a lot of patrons that like to eat at the bar, and people have become more curious about oysters, clams, mussels, and the like. And uh, our staff is very knowledgeable and can provide them with the information. Great. Well, I think we're going to taste a little bit. Let's check it out. All right. As you can see, it's a beautiful view off the mezzanine to the outside and even down into the dining area. And I read somewhere that you used to have bees on your rooftop. Sure. Next time you visit, they should be visible right out those windows. We raised them. They provided us with honey that we sold at the restaurant. So you use them in your cooking style? Oh, yeah, absolutely. In fact, this week we have a honey-infused menu week. What are some of the favorite dishes of your patrons here at this restaurant? Well, crab meat is a big one. Uh, predominantly, uh, people will order our lump crab meat dishes. We have jumbo lump crab meat served hot or cold with brown butter or cocktail sauce. We have a crab meat au gratin, a crab meat with cheese, crab cocktail, and there's crab meat in our combinations and a lot of other dishes. Aside from the crab meat, we have a full array of fish and uh, shellfish, and uh, everything's delivered daily. What you'll get at Ewell's was in the water yesterday. That's awesome. So, uh, Can't uh, get fresher. Absolutely. Great, well here's the food now and it smells oh, incredible. Crab cake looks great. I'm anxious to try it for sure. Can you tell me where the name Yules came from? I understand that the restaurant was started outside of Easton. In 1925, a gentleman named Bob Yule bought the business and renamed it. We opened this location in 1992, but it's been a tradition for generations. Through my research, I found it's probably one of the longest continuously operating restaurants in the area. How long has your chef been with you? He's been with us over eight years. Uh, and uh, Chef Tim uh, uh, grew up on the Jersey Shore, started uh, in the restaurant business as a, as a young boy and grew up and worked at some of the finest establishments in New Jersey, Philadelphia and uh, later Lehigh Valley. So we have a great working relationship. He's a very talented guy, comes up with some great dishes every week. In addition to the regular menu, the chef's feature menu uh, changes every week, so we'll have a, a half dozen different offerings. Great. It sounds awesome. Although those crabs over there, I'm not sure that I'm going to get into that, but for those people that are newbies to the seafood world, you guys do a lot of different food pairings with your beverages. Yeah, absolutely. We've expanded our, our beer selection. We're working with uh, um, Chinese the Beer Authority, okay. so we have a full complement of craft beers on tap. Um, Looks like this is one of your specialty cocktails. Yeah, that's our Apis Melifera. We have a full line of specialty cocktails in addition to our wine list, which is extensive as well. Sounds great. Well, I'm anxious to try these soft shell crabs. It smells They're incredible. They're one of my favorites. In fact, I want you to have the first bite. Uh, I know you've never had them, but I think you're going to enjoy them a lot. Here you go. Really? Really? Absolutely. Actually, wow, that is really good. Can't wait to the come best. back and try it again. Okay. <laughs> I've been waiting two years to have soft shell crabs. We didn't have any last year with the fire. Oh, really? Why? Sorry. <laughs> Why? Because we didn't, because this was an empty, because this was an empty lot. <laughs> I need that martini. 